be honest, did you go out there because you were trying to run away from your season being on the greatest? <laughs> ever? Like, no, wow. you, know, you know what? So, no, we were actually in Dallas when that aired, and that was such a funny thing for us because. Jordan had never seen it. I and I it. felt like I got the pass. Like, I feel like a lot of couples go through that thing and it sometimes it ends up in an argument or a yeah. disagreement, whatever it is. And I was like, oh, I don't even have to deal with that. Then the second time they aired it, he loved it. He was like rooting for all the other guys. I'm like, <laughs> this is weird, but I kind of like it. Like, you're fun. I love it. <laughs> I remember looking at that and I'm like, ah, see, that's when you know you've reached a certain level because it's like growth, maturity, those little things don't bother you. Someone literally asked me the other day, is it hard when your significant other has to watch your season back? And I said, yes, because you can tell them every single detail and it's totally different when then they watch it and their friends and their family are sure. watching it and they're mm -hmm. questioning things. So it's so great that like both times were a win for you. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah for sure. I mean, they said the time, the only time you watch it was four years later. So that probably helped, I mean, you know, <laughs> so, but yeah, it was so much fun watching it back. Yeah. Well, and it's good. It's like, and we, I feel like we've always had the bachelorettes on it. It's a fun walk down memory lane. And at this point, you know, a few years removed, there's not that weird, awkward. I feel like everyone for the most part gets along with totally their exes. And I'm sure Jordan got along with most of the dudes. So it's, yeah, yeah. I can't imagine that, like <laughs> having to, to relive that a little bit.